So then, uh, in this video, I will be doing an urban exploring of the old Concord Market in Briley Hill. Now, the Concord Market was one of the markets in Briley Hill to rival the main market, the Briley Hill Market, which still stands today. However, the Concord Market in Briley Hill has now been run down. Now, as you probably remember, the Concord Market had three units, the main market, the fruit market and the discount centre. And uh, the fruit market closed down and I will be telling you more on what has changed to the market since uh, Concord left Briley Hill. And then the Concord main market uh, closed down um, in 2013, so there's only a Concord market left in Sedgley. And now uh, the Concord Market has been turned into cheapo shops now and only the Concord Discount uh, has not yet been taken over. So anyway, let's start the video. So anyway, this was where the Fruit Market was. Um, not anymore. Um, it is now uh, changed to Pound Stretcher. And just before uh, Pound Stretcher came along, it's been only £2, which didn't last very long. It went bust. It was bought by Bargains and More, uh, which was a cheaper version of B&M. And then later on, it became Smiley's Plumbing. It had been a bed shop as well, and now it's called Pound Stretcher. So anyway, here is the Concord Discount Centre, still been vacant for quite a long time now. And as you probably remember, the Concord Discount was one of the most popular stores on behalf of the Concord family, sadly it's now uh, empty and vacant. So no one has been in this unit ever since the Concord discount had closed down. It was such a popular uh, location to be, especially in partnership with the Concord market itself. As you can see, the shutters are still down. And uh, it's been, it's been a, a shame since Concord market has been closed down. As you probably know, this video was done on essential uh, travel up to Brawley Hill to go to Brawley Hill Asda. Uh, as you can probably tell that this is during the COVID-19 pandemic in 2020. And uh, this uh, unit is still closed and still vacant. Now anyway, this is Dixio Chicken. Before this used to be the fish and chip shop um, of the Concord Market. It used to be linked into the Concord Market uh, in Brawley Hill, one of the most popular, cheaper locations to be. As you can see, Dixio Chicken uh, is now cheap and nasty. Uh, not really interesting compared to the popular Concord Fish Bar. And uh, there's no direct link into the old Market Hall now because Market Hall is now being taken over by someone else which I will come to in a little while. So Dixio Chicken is only a smaller independent hospitality venue. As you know, hospitality venues are open, but only for takeaway uses only. You can't eat in because so they can reduce the spread of the coronavirus. So anyway, here is the entrance to the old Concord Market Hall, just right by the cake shop. This is now a branch of a frozen food chain called Farm Foods, and they have taken over quite a few... Uh, areas in in the west midlands like there's still one up in dudley which uh is due to close down anytime soon to make way for part of the new dudley bus station so anyway this is the entrance as you can see the gates have survived they used to be blue but now they've been painted black and uh so anyway let's do an urban exploring in this old market also anyway there's the entrance to the market hall as you remember, there was a speaker in the gateway, but there isn't anymore. So, as you can see, the doors are now black. They used to be blue when it was Concord Market, and Concord Market used to be so bustling. So, anyway, here is the urban exploring of this old Market Hall entrance. This is the entrance to the old Concord Market place. And now this is the entrance hall to the old Concord Market. You can also tell that the uh, 
that there's a bit of blue paint peeling off from the black paint. So anyway, here's the inside of the old Concord Market, now Farm Foods. Uh, it's not uh, really interesting compared to when it was the Concord Market, when you used to have the fans, the, the speakers and all the busy people. It's not really interesting to how it used to be before. It looks really dead now. It just looks rather boring, really cleaned up and dull because when it was the Concord Market it was all retro and it was all interesting to be but now since it's been turned into a frozen food chain it's not really interesting uh, than it used to be quite boring really uh, rather dull as you can see that uh, the ramp and the stairs was not included when it was the market the they actually added an additional mezzanine uh, to access uh, the farm foods, as you can see, farm foods is uh, like a frozen food chain to rival with the likes of um, Heron Foods and uh, Iceland. Because Iceland was the only frozen food chain in Brolly Lie Street along with Cool Trader, which no longer exists. And uh, so this is the inside of uh, the farm foods uh, in Brawley Hill and uh, one of the most smallest supermarkets in Brawley Hill town centre because uh, in Brawley Hill there is um, free supermarkets, farm foods, um, Iceland and even Asda and down at Merry Hill you've got Iceland again and you've got Asda. So anyway here's the outside of the farm foods uh, in Brawley Hill on the car park, the back end as you can see this was the old entrance to the back entrance to the old Concord indoor market and when this was the old concord indoor market it was always busy and bustling there used to be a cafe right at the back end not anymore because it's now a farm foods it the the uh the farm foods was so uh was so it's so dull these days when it was concord market it was uh it, it was so retro style and i really really loved it because i used to love going into the concord market when i was young and it was such a popular location to be but not anymore because it looks cleaned up and dull oh, i wish i wish they kept it in the concord market condition because it would have been so nice if they kept it in that condition because i really love the concord market it was one of the most popular market places Hello. to be uh in um in brawley hill and um uh, it's been such a disappointment that that to close the Concord Market in Brawley Hill because I really love the Concord Market, and uh, it has been a, such a a big shame to be here in Brawley Hill. So anyway, uh, the next store we come to is Block uh, B. Uh, this is Pound Stretcher, formerly uh, only two bargains and more, and uh, Smiley's Plumbing Centre. This was the um this was where the fruit market was and this is the back entrance uh, to the store as you can see that um that uh they that they've painted the building red now rather than keeping it blue as you remembered concord market only two and and bargains and more was blue and uh it has been such a shame and as you probably remembered only two was sh sh closed on sundays and then only two went bust because they weren't making enough money because you've got pound land in the town of course you've got two pound shops in this town well three because you've got merry hill nearby for their pound shop and one below f which counts as four so you'd have pound stretcher, pound the two pound lands, and then you would have uh one below as well. So this is the back entrance uh to the pound stretcher in uh Brawley Hill. And anyway, let's go inside. So as you can see, here's the inside of the pound stretcher. Uh looking rather cleaned up and dull. When this was Concord Market, it was it was so nice and grotty. I really love these grotty places, but sadly, uh, it looks so dull now. It doesn't look even grotty. As you know, I really love these grotty places, and like I love the awesome grotty locations, like um, like Beatties of Wolverhampton. That's now gone because after this lockdown ends in three weeks' time, uh, Beatties may likely to be remain closed for good. Because the relocation 
into Fraser's in the Manda Centre. And it's been a huge shock to say goodbye to all these grotty places. And grotty places were all my favourite subjects of all time. And uh, I really love grotty places. But sadly, they're getting rid of them now and replacing them with these awful um, dull places. And I really do miss them. It's such it's such a big shock to, to me. But however, no one cares about grotty places they think it's just a place where they just need to go to get stuff and uh what a big shock to say goodbye to these uh grotty uh locations because back in the day there were always good shops to go to but not anymore they look so dull and uh well like it is a big shock uh to see how bad these places are so anyway, there is the side entrance to the old Concord Discount. Concord Discount, like I said, as remains closed for the rest of its time now in Briley Hill. So we don't know who's going to be taken over. Because, as you can probably tell, this building is getting run down these days. The building is actually falling apart. And I can't see whoever wants to take over these units and what i would like to say to everyone thank you for watching and please continue to stay safe and continue to stay at home to protect the nhs and save lives and thank you very much for watching